Welcome back to Nana Debbie's Kitchen. We're going to make a candy recipe tonight called Christmas Cracker Candy. And I'll put a recipe on my website at nanadebbieskitchen.com. Uh, preheat the oven to 375, which I've done. So to line a uh, 13 or 15 by 10 by 1 inch baking pan, which I've done, uh, with parchment paper. Spray the parchment paper with nonstick spray and then line it with saltine crackers. Oh, the other thing is try to get the crackers uh, as much as you can close together so that what we're going to put on top here is not going in between the crackers but on it. In a large saucepan, combine two sticks of butter. With one cup of packed brown sugar, this was packed, I just dumped it in here. I'll let that butter melt a little bit first. This candy, if you've never had it before, these crackers, this brown sugar uh, and butter, that'll, that'll all be like a toffee layer. It's so good, it's addicting. Let's put our brown sugar in. It says to bring to a boil over medium high heat and boil for three minutes, stirring constantly. All right, well, we're cooking this. It's looking really good. And it says to pour it over the top of the cracker mixture. can see what it looks like and it says to bake it uh, for five minutes. Now we're going to put the chocolate chips on. Okay, I'm just going to kind of smooth this out a little. some caramel bits. So we're going to use those. And some crushed up uh, pretzels. Give it a little crunch in there. And some chopped pecans. I'm going to let this set up and then I'll be back in a few minutes because the last thing that goes on it is some melted white chocolate that you kind of drizzle on. I melted some white chocolate and I'm just going to drizzle it. in our freezer for 20 minutes. I've taken this out of the freezer and just broke it up in pieces and put it on a platter. And this piece, so you can see, it makes like a toffee uh, bottom layer. That's what I cooked on this, uh, this hot plate and then pour it on. And uh, everything is kind of layered up. Well, let's see, I know it's good because we've made this before. This is fantastic. You absolutely must try this recipe. It is so good. Come back and join me again, and I've got lots of other good Christmassy type things to make. Thank you.